Communities that care often highlights businesses and nonprofits doing good deeds. This morning, we're shining a light on an East St. Paul church that is uplifting people with action as well as prayer. We have people who say that this is the only time they leave their house or they don't feel comfortable going anywhere else. Every Wednesday night from 530 to 630, the outside of our Redeemer Lutheran Church turns into a drive through There are free hot meals. You can also find groceries. We are very fortunate to have community partners helping, uh, helping us to rescue food. We get a lot of food rescue from uh, local grocery stores and food shelves. You can also often find clothes, masks, and always comfort. A lot of people just need somebody to talk to. Jennifer Schneider is a deacon at the church. She explained how years ago, our Redeemer became a dining site for the nonprofit Lowe's of Fishes. But like everything else, the pandemic forced the church to figure out how to feed the growing need in the community. We have new volunteers every week and there's always somebody saying, hey, how can I give back? You've really helped my family and I would love to come and volunteer with you. But as the saying goes, without darkness, there can be no light. We hope that this is a catalyst for future ways to connect with our community. Everything the church does with this program is volunteer based. So if you'd like to contribute, whether that's in person or with a food donation or even a monetary gift, we've got a link for you to check out on carelevin.com slash sunrise. Good work. Mm -hmm, sure is. Now, if you know someone, a nonprofit or business making an impact in the community, email us at sunrise at carelevin.com. We'd love to share their story.